This video will cover the creation of a block, including an attribute. The point of this video is the attribute, not the block. So I'll create a circle with a diameter of 1. I'll then select this circle and type B to define a block. And I'll call this block tag. I'll pick a base point, the center of the circle. I've already selected my objects. And I'll check Open in Block Editor, where I'll define an attribute. To define an attribute, I'll type ATT. And the tag must be one word, can't contain spaces, and it's kind of a placeholder for the object. I'll call it tag underscore block. The prompt is what will display in the command line when the block is inserted. I'll say, what is the tag number? And the default will just be a number symbol. I'll set my justification to middle center, and I'll choose a text height of 0.3. I'll just say OK, and use the center O snap again to place my tag attribute into the middle of the circle. I'll close the block editor, save the changes, and I've created the block. To see how it works, let's insert the block. I for insert, choose the block named tag, say OK. So I'm prompted for an insertion point. I'll pick the insertion point, and my command line says, what is the tag number? And the default is the number sign. Now I can put a value in, and it'll go into my tag. Blocks can have multiple attributes and are useful for things like title blocks.